Actually, this afternoon, it's a Friday, I never forget also, man. About 1.30, two guys just walking the entrance of my gate. They, well, I think they call buy food, so I look for greet them because they walk towards my kitchen and they ask me if, as they walk in, they open the door and say, This is a robbery. Two of my, co two of my staff there with uh, the two of my assistant cooks. Gone up on the ground, I got my son, Ian's the Castro Jr. He's the one who answered the phone today, and I'm doing a good seal today also, and I got everything. He really, really done me a damage today, no lie. Because today I do good, and they just really come up for me, and I don't know, man, a real, real true back for me. It would seem as though this is the result of an inside job in terms of the men knowing where they're coming in terms of your property and what they were looking for. Do you believe that this was probably planned or orchestrated by someone who you know? Yeah, yeah, cause time to time I get a couple of them and run for the delivery for me, but also I don't make them bring back cash, but they must have just sister them for real, man. So that the way come out it today. So a real, real true back for me. And yeah, we got it over three thousand dollars. So make actually this morning I got a credit union for so extra cash, and I'm in need to pay my workers there today. So all of that they got with my chain, my phone, a real brush down there to me. No lie. Now you've made a police report. Uh, what has become of that so far? Has anybody been arrested, or is anybody in custody at the moment? No, not really. But the police, they look into it. I got a very well police officer with a customer too, and actually like four of them come by so salads for me because they into the healthy food, and that's one of my most dishes also. Cause I got a chef salad that I do every day, and I got a couple of the police guys who come today, and but four of them pass through, but they just go a little bit too early, man. No lie. So that going on to this, but the police they do their job, man. I just not get no call yet for see if they tell me anything, but they got a clue of who are the person. So I just for me here yeah, so good news after this, man. Now in terms of your security and the safety of your area, do you believe that now you need to be more vigilant in terms of people who come to buy from you, in terms of how you do business around here, that you're being watched? Well, that's true that too, but you see everybody that's our customer, because um, I sell food and sometimes people send the food to go pick up because I am usually sometimes delivery kind of late and so, so people, I mean my food, so, my food is really good, so people still no wait for my delivery, they go pick it up themselves, so it could be anybody walking my gate, everybody is welcome, so I know I lie, so I don't like my gate lock and everything, so anybody welcome, come in, go pick up a order for such a place or such a person, and we got it packed and ready for them, so we can't turn back nobody, so. That's the way they got me by. And also my son made a work with me today and uh, he, I mean, you know, he's so shocked for witness something like that too, because he's only 16 years old and I really feel bad for my workers also, two ladies on the ground, son on the ground, and then a school guy, like um, his cousin also on the ground, me on the ground, man. <laughs> that was sick.